The sun has set on a 14-year Italian adventure. A tour of Serie A that took an Argentinian centre-back of spirit and fight to four major footballing cities. Nicolas Burdisso fiercely defended the colours of Inter, then spent five seasons in the capital at Roma, before moving on to Genoa and finally Torino. He retired in October. Is it a sign of the times? He posted the news on Twitter. Hanging up your boots is the most difficult thing for a footballer. Aside from anything else, deciding to retire pulls you into a completely different world. It makes you a lot more vulnerable, riddled with insecurity and doubt. That said, I have managed to make the dreams I had when I was a child a reality, and I have no regrets. A man of genuine charisma, with a forceful personality, Burdiso was a natural leader. He won championships and earned the respect of fans and colleagues alike. Tough and loyal, the Argentine was the last player to wear the number three shirt of Inter's legendary captain Giacinto Facchetti before it was retired. You play the same way you live. Anything you do off the field, you bring onto it as well, and vice versa. I like to make sure every detail is taken care of so I can improve as a person. If you improve as a person, you improve as a player. I have always believed that the greatest thing a player can experience is scoring a goal. When you score, all eyes are on you. You're in a state of ecstasy. Everything feels incredible. I didn't experience that moment much because I was a defender. I scored 25 or 30 goals in my career. However, it was more than enough to realize that scoring is the absolute best feeling in football. After that, winning has to be a close second. Winning alongside your teammates, achieving the objective you've all worked so hard for, is an incredible satisfaction. It is the purest essence of football. The group, the squad, becomes a reflection of society in general. While there are some differences, like the fact we get more than most and get to experience things most can only dream of, something we need to keep in mind, we still share the same problems as everyone else. We have the same values and dreams. That is one of the best parts of being a footballer. Within the dressing room, you find all sorts and can share so much. And it is an important element for the team to do well. The centre-back helped Inter win four league titles under Roberto Mancini and Jose Mourinho. But he also experienced three intense years at the Luigi Ferraris, where he established himself as Genoa's captain. Divided loyalties then, when the two sides meet at San Siro on Saturday. I expect Inter Genoa to be a very hard-fought game. Spalletti has a terrific squad. The quality of the players at his disposal is significantly higher than those at Genoa. On the other hand, Genoa have a coach who's given the team a clear identity. They won't be going to San Siro to shut up shop. They'll do their best to win. I think it's going to be a very enjoyable game to watch, a very intense match, with little room for mistake, and it will be decided by the star players. Inside their own half as Piatek opens up the space. Piatek! Everyone's been surprised by Piontek. His strongest defining feature is his competitiveness. It's been a great surprise for the league, and even more for Genoa, who have always relied on players like him. Mauro Icardi lies in wait till the perfect moment to strike, just like in the last minute of the derby. It is his biggest strength. And inside the box, he's lethal. He knows exactly how to move. Burdiso's great-grandparents emigrated from Piemonte to Argentina. Understandable then that he's made Italy his home and is staying in Turin. And he's staying in the game too, studying coaching, a new vocation. As a coach, I think it'd be very similar to how I was on the field. Becoming a coach is a calling for me. It is almost as if I need to become a coach. Football is and has always been key for me. It was a key for happiness when I was a child, a key to making friends and to developing as a person, and then it became a key to spread a message, to be an example for others. I believe that it is the best way to view football. 
penso che il calcio usa If you only use it for selfish means it loses its purpose. Divertimento o per egoismo non ha servito a nulla.